Blessings, my viewers. Welcome back to the channel. Watch, like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell if you're also new to the channel. Idris are among three arrested for a scamming. A 19 year old Idris was among three persons arrested and charged in Hanover on Tuesday for a latch scamming offense in two operations carried out by the investigators assigned to the latch scamming task force, which is based in Montego Bay, St. James. According to police report, Three persons who are all from the address in Orange Bay Anova were charged with possession of identity information and possession of accused access device in the first of two operations which was carried out at approximately 4.30 a.m. A two-bedroom dwelling house which was occupied by a man and a woman was searched during the search two cell phones belonging to the man were found to be populated with names address and telephone numbers and bank information and persons residing overseas the man and the woman identified as 27 year old dino vashani and 19 year old Ajasa amaya smith of church lane in orange bay the court date for their first appearance in court has not yet been finalized. Later, about 9 a.m., 27 year old Carl Wayne White, an auto repairman of Ralph Road in Orange Bay, was arrested and charged following an operation at his home. During a search of his two his house, two cell phones with photographs of lead sheets were found. Further search revealed Microsoft Excel files populated with names and address telephone numbers and banking information of person residing overseas latches coming remains a serious problem in the parish despite the success we have been arresting scammers said superintendent sharon b put the commander officer for anova police division last year we arrested 23 persons for scamming and so far six have been convicted in addition we dismantled three major scamming syndicates in the parish. Yeah, man, my viewers, eh? a lot of scammers, them still at it, you know? Yeah, man, still at it, a ramp up the one go, you know? But, don't know, it is what it is, you know? So, no matter how much people, them are going to arrest, that just scamming just now, go just go away like that. So in other news, cocaine case against airport employee for February 28th. The three former Sangsters International Airport employees who are facing drug charges stemming from allegations that they tried to smuggle 11.4 kg of cocaine on the Canada bone flight in 2021 will know their fate on February 28th when their trial will either continue are the case against them dismissed. Ingra White, Berlin Warid, and Romario Carr, whose trial began in St. James Parish Court on November the 16th last year, had their bail extended to the new court date after their lawyer made a joint application on Tuesday, February 21st, for the matter to be dismissed for what of prosecution. The application was made by after presiding parish judge Sasha Marie Ashley was told by the prosecution that a police witness who had been given testimony in the trial was absent due to illness. The court was also told that statement from overseas witness which should have been added to the case file are not yet received. So you hear that my viewers? Not yet received. So, I don't know what is that. So, viewers, we'll be giving more updates on that situation as soon as it becomes available. But for right now, my viewers, that's where it is for now. So, viewers, just continue to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell if you're also new to the channel. Remember, the more you like the video, the more YouTube recommend it among its algorithm. The more, the better. So viewers, just do what's the right thing to do. 
like, share, comment and subscribe. Turn on your post notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I release a fresh video.